Wow, wow, wow. It has been a second, but look at this. I don't think this set needs any introduction. This is Vivid Voltage. The card that we're looking for is right here on the front. El Gigante Pikachu, AKA Humongous Jungus Pika Jumbus. <laughs> yeah, we're looking for a fat Pikachu. It's uh, it's in this set. It's a hyper rare. What the, what the fuck? Is this, is this box wrapped in co cocaine? Coquina. Yeah, we're gonna try to find the humongous Pikachu. Oh my God, this this box or this wrapper, this right here is just falling apart. Look at all this. No, flower. Looks like I have a drug problem. Or I just powdered my testicles. You know, sometimes, especially when it starts getting warmer out and your balls get a little swampy. Just me? No? Nobody else? Ladies? I mean, I know you guys don't understand what swamp balls are, obviously, but maybe swamp vagina? <laughs> That's such a disgusting thing to say. I'm so sorry. Anyway, let's open some packs. Like I said, it's been a, a little while. Hey, look, a green pack. That's always a good start. I think it's just four to the front. That's right. It's not a special set. How's this angle? Is this too low? Oh, geez. I can't tell. There's beauty. I mean, she's pretty pretty. She's pretty pretty. She's a pretty beauty. Anyway, there's a shuffle. Nuzleaf. Execute. Eevee. Uh, Aracuda. That's one I haven't run into yet in the game. There's a Woobat. Oh, that's adorable. It's a precious little Woobat. I want to pet him on his head. A C dot, a reverse hollow Shedinja. And our rare is, wow, I don't want to pet that. That is an Exploud. He is angry. Code, just for you guys. Here, I didn't show the green code earlier. Here, you can have this one too. Ba-boom. Now I don't have to figure out which ones I showed and which ones I didn't. I can just throw away all of them. <laughs> all right. We have a hero's medal. Hit him on top. Crook, uh, crook, crook, Jesus. Crocorock. Execute. He's just gonna be in every pack. So is Woobat, apparently. Beldum. He looks so sad. Like, did somebody forget their Beldum in the woods? Like Charmander, this Blitzel. Milk, milk. That is, that's wiener juice. We are reverse hollow is a Clefairy. And, ooh, we have a nice hollow Shaman. That's pretty. I like that. I like that form of Shaman, too. I know that, what is there? A couple of forms of Shaman? It's like Zygarde, maybe just two. Zygarde has like 173 different forms. Yeah, here's a code for you. I think I like that version of a version of Shaman more where he looks less, sh I just cannot speak, where he looks less like a hedgehog. I don't like hedgehog Shaman. That's a mouthful. Go-Goat, as I like to call him, Gogurt. Uh, Wyndham Stadium, a Tang. He's not as sad as the Beldum. Brockruff. Talo, or Talo, Yanma, Booper, there's a Dedene. That literally looks like a figurine. I want that figurine. Can I have it? Give it to me. Uh, oh, a Reverse Hollow is a Charmeleon, and a Cape of Toughness. Is that Leon's cape? That's beautiful. I think that means that our chances of getting a Pikachu are probably pretty slim now that we just pulled a Secret Rare, but it doesn't mean it's impossible. Nothing is impossible. Except for me getting pregnant. I don't think that's possible. If it is, I, I still do not want to. At all. <laughs> anyway, there we go. Cape of Toughness, our first card. That is pretty. We have a, a, a Jumbus Chew here. Maybe inside of the Jumbus Chew pack, we will actually have a Jumbus Chew. But like I said, because we just pulled a Secret Rare so early in the box, the chances are somewhat slim. But that's fine, because I haven't opened the set at all. So I know there's, what, Amazing Rares in here? Some other really pretty cards. Th that is not one of them. Telescopic Sight. It looks like a, a play school toy. Ferrothorn. Go Goat. Whalmer. Dynamo. There's an Execute. Chatot. We have a Clobopus. What a horrifying creature. Fortress. I like that. That's a nice looking fortress. And we have a Yon Mega. My favorite Pokemon to take out fighting type Rocket Grunts with on Pokemon Go. <laughs> Let me get rid of some of this crack cocaine that's all over my mat now, because I don't want it getting all over the cards. I don't understand what was going on. I guess maybe it was the print on that on that foil or the, the wrapper itself. Maybe it didn't secure very well. That was weird. As soon as I pulled that box apart, it was just shooting crack cocaine all over the place. Anyway, we have a Swellow, Zebstrika, Dusclops, Drillbur. I really like that art. 
Look at the lighting on them too. That's nice. It actually looks like a photograph that someone took a photo of. Wilmer, Cotney, we have a Clobopus. These cars are flying all over the place. Electric, Clobopus again, because why not? And a Whimsicott. Why not Whimsicott? Why not? It's a Pokemon too, isn't it? That would uh, evolves into Boba Fett. Yep. Took me a second. I knew exactly what I was looking for. I just couldn't find it. Here's a little code for you. Oh, probably help if I put it over here. That's the thing with recording with my phone. I got to remember that it's like not really centered. Camera's over to the left. There's a Puccinia. Oh, that art is so cool. Voltorb. Uh, Ferris seat. I forgot to do the card trick. There's an Electros. That's our rare. That's a dope art though. Does he have arms? Has he had arms this whole time? Moo Moo Cheese. Oh, I love it. Sableye. Galvantula. That's a really cool art. Looks like a comic book. I'm still fucked up over Electros having arms. Since when has that dude had arms? You guys like how we're like, what? Six packs deep to this set? The only thing we've pulled so far has been a secret rare. I don't think it gives me hope or the complete opposite. We got a fire energy. We got a uh, my girl Bia or B, whatever. Do what? Do what? <laughs> Is it do it? Do it. I just call him do what? Aromatic energy. A tiny little joltic. Is he playing? He's playing with the electrical outlet. You should know better. Cottony, Mud Bray. He's getting muddy. Slugma. He's looking at Grandpa. <laughs> I mean, not really. Wismer, that's a very sad Wismer. Oh my God. There's a Voltorb and, ooh, we have a Steelix V. He is pissed. He is very angry. I really like that art though. Background hollow is really nice. I got a code for you. And there it is. Did you get it? I hope so. I've had a few glasses of wine and I gotta say, my tolerance for alcohol is not what it used to be. I don't drink a whole lot, really ever. Oh my God, this wine is fighting back. As soon as I said something, Excadrill, Macargo, uh, Nessa, fine ass, Beldum, Wooper, uh, Cumpuddle, Ninkata, Wismer. Ooh, we got our first amazing rare, it's Celebi. God, these are so good looking. Look how the energy symbols have like texture on them. The fact that they like explode off the card is such a cool idea. Ooh, look at that, and a Colossal V. That's a hell of a pack right there. That Celebi is so nice. I really like that card a lot. That's really nice. Code for you. I've already got a double pack. That was nice when we get two rares in one pack. Or two like good rares rather. It's Pinkurchin, Voltorb. So I'm excited to see, um, oh, I love that drill bear. I'm excited to see if we get more. The centering on this set, I have to say, or at least on this box in particular, for the most part, as soon as I said that, I pull out a Golvantula that looks like ass. Centering has been pretty good so far. I like that Samurai art too. This set's got really nice art. I cannot deny that. So like the centering on that Celebi is really nice. I kind of want to grade it. Except for the fact that PSA is backed up so far right now that I probably won't see it until 2032. Code for you. No, like PSA is seriously so backed up that they just changed pricing on some of their grading services to sort of suggest to people to not grade right now. I guess it's probably the best way to put it. Uh, oh, that pineco looks so cool. Those colors are so nice. Mudbray, Virginia, Charmander, Shadot. Oh, I gotta keep that Snorlax. Big old chonky Joe. And then a Zero Rouge. Yeah, yep, him. Uh, but so you could always grade through other services like BGS and CGC, which are the top three, including PSA. Right now, I would say so the grading services out there. I don't know a ton about them. And I don't think they're super desirable as far as collectors go. Like, I think there's one called SGC. I could be totally wrong about that, too. I do not know. Uh, I do know that we have an Alistair, though. Matang, Kuna, Electric, Execute, Eevee, Boobat. A lot of those three, too, or a lot of those three in packs together. Uh, Aracuda, Hero's Metal, and an Executor. Look how thick he is. My God. Been eating lots of berries. So... I got off track there. I can't remember exact all oh, the grading services. Yeah, so I'm not really in a huge rush to grade right now. Not that I ever really was anyway, but especially now. <laughs> when I see cards that I pull that look like they could grade well, I'm just like, ah, maybe one day. There's Cramorant. He's not eating a Pikachu this time. Drone Rotom, of course. Swoobat. Cum Puddle. 
Larry and Meowth. Chimeco. Oh, I always love the yarn cards. They look so cool. Blitzel. Slugma. Our reverse hollow is a Barra Scuda. Or Scuda, whatever. Oh my god, that's one of the coolest Metagross arts I've ever seen. Oh, that's so badass. That is so cool. I've never seen him make him look like that tall, I guess, with his legs. He always looks like he's a little bit more spread out with his spider-like looks. But him looking super tall like that with that art style looks bad ass. I love it. There we go. See, what do you think our other amazing rare is gonna be? Uh, was it a Veltal and Tyogre? Are these the only ones in this set? I don't remember what all is in this set. Um, at all, actually, this is the first time I've opened it. Reverse Hollow Puccinia and a Mudsdale. Looking angry. He's looking angry because he saw those those uh, those mud break cards that we had earlier, where he's just rolling around in the mud. He's got to clean them off. Oh, whoops. Here we go. You guys haven't figured out yet. Green codes mean there's nothing in here. That doesn't... Oh, my God. That doesn't mean there won't be an amazing rare, but there won't be anything higher than just a regular rare in the pack, like a, uh, a non-holo rare, which you guys will see here very shortly. See? Just another Metagross that we were talking about. I'm not even mad about getting that one. That card looks so awesome. All right. Jumbo Pikachu pack. Please contain a Jumbo Pikachu. That code... Means that there's something in this pack that is hollow or better. Look at that demonstration. It's like I planned it, but I did not. Let's see here. We have a Crocker Rock, Delmise, pretty dope art, Rocky Helmet, Wismer, Drillbur. God, I love that. Whalmer, Cotney, Clobopus. God, that name. Yanma in our regular. Or our reverse hollow rare is a Yanma. Our non-regular rare, because it's going to be something better, is a Zapdos Hollow. That is a sick art. Lots of angry looking Pokemon in this set. It's like they're taking band photos. You're not allowed to take a band photo and smile. Nope. Every time you take a band photo, you got to look tough and angry. I don't know why, but that seems to be the way it goes. <laughs> oh, I just destroyed that pack. Oh, it's a channel. All right. Cargo. Oh, that's really nice. League Staff. Rock-a-Rock. Judo -rock. again. Same one from earlier. Riolu, the bottom of him looks like a ball sack. Why would you do that? Poor guy. Eevee. C Dot. Electrike. A reverse hollow is a Wyndham Stadium and a big old thick executor. Being an egg. Well, he's a tree. He evolved from an egg. Which. <coughs> Let's talk about that for a second. The last time that I checked, things that come out of eggs are typically animals, chickens, birds, snakes. I've never seen somebody take some eggs and I don't even know what would happen. Water them? Train them? How do you train eggs? Then they turn into a, a fucking tree? I mean, Pokemon has had some strange evolutions, but that's one of the ones that's always kind of baffled me. Like, let's take this baker's dozen of eggs, turn them into a large tree with some coconuts hanging on it. I don't know what those people were, were smoking, but I will take some, a lot of it. Oh, we got a white code. Here's my card, take it. We got ourselves a lightning energy, that's a good start. And then we have a stone energy. So many energies. There's electric, okay, Kuna. Duskull, Pharaoh Seed, Riolu, oh, old Satchel Riolu. The sand dial look all happy. It's like Chester when he's about to get some food. Weedle, from that angle, looks like he's just nothing but fat rolls. That's what I look like from that angle. Ooh, that is so beautiful with the purple. Oh my God, that's one of the prettiest cards I may have ever pulled. Forget the Charizards, look at that thing. That is so gorgeous. And we got a Dialga. Whatever. Screw the Dialga. Look at that. That is so good looking. Man, oh man, I love that. That looks great. So I guess that answers our question of which ones are in this set. Because it was neither of the ones that I had mentioned earlier. <laughs> Looks like we got another Hollow. I keep forgetting to not reveal the code. Because I'm a dummy. Dusclops. Ooh, that's sick. He's so dark and 
Spooky. Beauty. Chuckle. Puccinia. Rock rough. What's in your ear, rock rough? I have no idea. Anyway, there's a Blitzel. Skidoo. Or Skiddo. Ferroseed. Reverse Hollow is an Encada. And. Woo hoo! -hoo! Look at that beautiful card. We have an Orbeetle VMAX floating around like a damn UFO. I really like Orbeetle. I think it's a really awesome Pokemon. The bug starters that you typically get, I mean, not like a starter, but you typically get them pretty early in the game. I've always enjoyed them. Sometimes I know they can be pretty ass, but uh, Orbeetle I thought was pretty dope. I played with him until probably mid 30s, level 30s, and then I put him away for something else. That's really cool. So what is it? When it goes into its VMAX form, it turns into a fucking spaceship? That is awesome. I haven't seen that yet. All right. Let's not reveal the code. I did it. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Aromatic energy. Hero's metal. I'm on top. Oh, with Bia back there. She's training. Plugma. Beldum. Uh, come. Wooper. Ninkata. A reverse hollow is zero rare. I like that more than the hollow. I think that looks great like that. Oh, we got a Drapion V. This box is loaded. Oh my God. Watch I say that we won't pull another single thing. Oh, I threw the pack on the wrong side, but it's too late. There's your code. Did you see it? Memory capsule. Gogurt. Yes, delicious Gogurt. Ferrothorn. Rockruff. Wismer. Rubbish. Dynamo. Woo bats! Oh, that's such a cool car. <laughs> Drone Rotom. And we have a Tornadus. Another hollow. This box has got lots of good stuff. There's not been very many just regular rares. I mean, just hollows alone. My god. Let's go through and look at those two. I guess we could wait to the end, but we're here now. Lots of hollows. We've already got five hollows on top of everything else we've gotten. That is pretty good pull rates. No Pikachu. Yet. Oh my god, we got another white code. This is insane. Wyndham. Batang. My Tiano. I haven't seen that card yet in this set. He's looking thick as hell. Voltorb. Mudbray. Joltik. Weedle. Tallow. Or Talo. We have a Swoobat and. Another Orbeetle! Why? There's so many of them! I was saying so many great things about Orbeetle. God, the centering on that is cheeks. The back looks good. But that left border is Jumbus. Jumbus Chungus. Beautiful card though, oh my gosh. Look, we have Orbeetle and Orbeetle VMAX. Both are full arts. Code for you. Almost did the card trick backwards, like showing the cards. Kind of defeats the purpose. We have Opal, Bia, or B, whatever, Duat, Dynamo. Uh, thing, Galarian Meowth, Chimeco, Blitzel, Reverse Hollow is a Whalmer, and, oh my god, uh, what is going on? What, why is this happening? Hey, there's another OP. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Not that I'm complaining at all. Please do not get that impression. I'm just kind of shocked. Pack for ya. Not even just the fact that they're all Orbeetles, just the fact that we're getting so many pools in general. This box is juicy. Juicy, juicy. Nessa. Swellow. Zepstrika. Valerian Meowth. Cottony. We have an Aracuda. And Kata. Sandile. And a Dreadnaw. Nessa back there in the background. Reminding me of that horrible gym fight. It actually wasn't that bad. It's still no Whitney. With that damn Moo Moo. Oh my god. As soon as I see Miltank and it starts using rollout, I want to roll out. Go play a different game. Let's take a look. You see, we got a Mighty Enna again. Pinkurchin. Loudred. That card is ridiculous. <laughs> Choodle. Uh, Riolu. Trimeco. Kata. Voltorb. We have a Matang and a Shiftry. That is a, that, yeah, that is an awesome Shiftry art. <laughs> I really like that a lot. The art in this set is probably the best I've seen Sword and Shield sets yet. Uh, that's including the special sets. Just a, a, across the board, this set has been great to look at. Just adorable, like with cards like this. And then the serious cards look really badass as well. 
This set is awesome. I wish I hadn't waited so long to open it. I think that's the first fire energy we've seen today. Am I wrong? Sableye, Galvantula, Go Goat, Bampy, Larian Meowth, Duskull, Skiddo, Yanma, and we have a telescopic sight and a Diancy or Diancy, whatever you want to say. All I know is that it's purple, and I love the color purple. So we'll add it to the hollow pile. I think I might have skipped another hollow when I was over here having a fit about something. I did not. All right, we're good. All right, how many packs do we have left? Not a ton. It's like 10? 9 or 10, somewhere around there. There we go. Curious to see how many pools are actually left in this box since it has been so nuts from the jump. I mean, the first like eight packs, all we had was that secret rare and then it went kind of crazy after that. It has been going nonstop. Halo, like these literally just look like figurines that were taken photos of or that they had taken photos of the figurines. Whatever it is, they look awesome. I really like them. Oshawott's got a beer belly. You looking chumbus, my friend. Pineco, Clefairy. There's a Terrakian and Barrascuta. Happy to have some cool sorts. Some cool sets. I was, you know, sets, cards, all the same word, of course. Swoobat. Just excited to have them open. Because uh, Pokemon is hard as hell to find right now. In stores, online. You basically got to pay scalpers or uh, resellers, whatever you want to call them. Ooh, that's a sweet Genesect. Another hollow for the hollow pile. Basically got to pay the uh, resellers because they are clearing stores out. It's absurd. <laughs> I mean, it really is, but it is what it is. It's not going to change anytime soon, it seems. I don't know that the popularity of Pokemon is going down or up right now. Sort of just seems like it's in the same spot. Not seeing nearly as many people breaking online uh, as there were around this time four, five, six months ago. The hype really exploded, but there's still people like Nogla and me and Tyler and obviously people who are just into the hobby still doing it pretty regularly. So that's all that matters. Getting down to the last few packs here. And our first pack of our first pack, our first box of Vivid Voltage will be done. And it has treated us very well, especially the ore beetles. Oh my gosh. I was talking about how much I like them and I got Pretty much every ore beetle you can, except for the hyper rare. God, Glarian Stunfisk is such a weird looking creature. Hello, Yanma. Unless there is a, is there a VMAX that's not full art? I feel like all VMAXs are full art, but I could be wrong. Dene, pick a peck, reverse hollow zip striker, and a Banette. Really love the Banette uh, GX that we got before. Was it a GX or was it a V? I don't remember. The full art was really cool. Like the zipper was like shiny and textury. And then its eyes were really shiny. That uh, looked really cool. Being nostalgic about Pokemon cards that came out like two years ago. <laughs> Wasn't that long ago. I'll tell you what, when I'm done recording this video, I'm ready for a big old glass of water. My throat is dry. Been talking longer than I have in a minute. Wyndham Stadium. See that. Pick a peck. Bud Bray. Joltik. Weedle. We have a reverse hollow C dot and a big old Chumbus Clefable. Look at that jambus. There's lots of fatties in this set. Lots of really good art and lots of fatties. I like both, especially when it's a good art of a fatty. Like that Clefable is a nice fatty artwork and I like it. <laughs> All right, can we get another amazing rare? That'd be cool. I think you're only supposed to get two in a box, but we can get three and break the rules, can't we? Drones, puppies. Dynamo. Oh, not in this pack, but we do have a Tornadus. That is an awesome looking art. Looks like Kaiba from Yu-Gi-Oh. Throwing out his final card. And a Donphin. <laughs> you guys might see what that is. That's the weirdest place to get a little boo-boo, isn't it? Right in the palm of your hand. Oh, Jesus. I just dropped everything. Thankfully, it was only one pack. I said it knock over the big stack of bulk. That would have been painful. That's one thing I've avoided for a while, is uh, all the bulk that I've collected from older videos. It's kind of just everywhere. Well, not everywhere. I've got it consolidated down to one room, but it's everywhere in that room. So it's everywhere. That's what I, yep, whatever. Skiddo, Eevee, Shuppet, Sandile, 
Machoodle, Reverse Hollow Kakuna, and... Kill him. Next pack. We've got three left. Let's make them good. We got a Steel Energy, Memory Capsule, Drafferig, Electric, Yep, Bampy, Shuppet, Puccina, oh come on, Voltorb, Rockruff, Reverse Hollow Charmander, and a Vaporeon. Beautiful card. God, this set is great. That Shuppet is messed up. Yeah, I don't that's how I looked after the last few days of trying to get this mic situated, but... No avail. Careless. Stone Energy. Electric. Chuppet. Skiddo. Ferroseed. Joltik. Sandile. We have a Reverse Hollow. And a... Oh, yeah! We got a big old fat Jumbus. What the hell is his attack? Or his ability? Gorman dies? What? Alright. The final pack, and it just so happens to be Jumbus Chew. Let us end on a good note. Here's the pack. Okay. Mighty Yenna, Beauty, Stone Energy, Picky Pack, Choodle, Riolu, Chimeco, and Kata. Our reverse hollow is a Stone Energy, and. Oh, yeah, we ended on a good note. Colossal V Max. Look at that big, angry, sharp, beautiful man. Or woman. It doesn't say. I'm not one to judge. That's a fantastic looking card. You get the angle where you can see the texture on there. It looks like a fingerprint almost. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful card. One of my new favorites in the in the new game. I like him a lot. I almost like Carcole more. But Cole Colossal is pretty awesome. So Hell yeah, I'm happy to end on an amazing note like that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I do appreciate it. And I hope you've enjoyed Vivid Voltage. Just the first box that I've touched. It took me almost 40 minutes to open it. That is not good. And, uh... <laughs> I will see you guys in the next Pokemon video. Again, sorry if the mic sounds a little bit like butt cheeks. I'm trying to get it situated, I promise. Thank you guys. We'll see you soon with another Pokemon video. I'm out! Oh god, I have so much trash to pick up.